It's rare that I catch you before you go to work in the morning on film. Look at this. Right. Is there a need? What you making? Bye, Daniel. Say bye bye, Daniel. Duh. So, good morning. It's Thursday, and Daniel just went to school. He'll have one day of summer school this week, which is good. I sent him off with Judy. She's back. We're all a bunch of gimpies around here between me with my leg, and yeah, we're all hurting this week. It's a new day, it's a nice day, and let's see what's going to happen. I should probably rest a little bit and then go to work. That's kind of what I really should do. I keep forgetting things today. Like I went upstairs to put the dog upstairs to get my cord, charge my phone, I got the cord. And uh, now I have to go back in to get it. I'm actually heading out to work in a few minutes. So yeah, got my cord. <laughs> Anyways, it's um, 1230. I'm walking funny because my leg is killing me. As I was getting ready, I started to feel really sick. I took my vital signs, you know, my, my blood pressure is 110 over 80, so that was good. But I was feeling very sick to my stomach, and I'm not sure. I do have an infection. My temp, I'm on 800 milligrams of Advil, so I'm at 99.8, and I'm on antibiotics, so that's good. But they don't see any kind of urgency. They said they can see me next week, so I can't stop my life totally probably could just lay in bed all day but honestly I'm there's some things I just need to try to keep keep moving along and I was in bed until like 11 o'clock and I'm kind of restless but I mean actually felt really good I got up I had breakfast and I felt good and then it was when I was getting dressed I started to feel kind of dizzy just gonna take it slow keep drinking tons of fluid it's also the the antibiotics makes me dizzy. Um, it's really, really strong. And the um, Advil is a lot, plus all my regular meds. So I'm a little bit, ah! Next Wednesday, the 27th, is when I'm going for my consultation uh, with the vascular surgical department. I don't know that that means I'm having surgery. They're, they're just the people who look at the veins to see if there's something that does or doesn't need to be done. I just really want to feel better again. Like I'm frustrated <laughs> anyway it's so beautiful there's so many things we could be doing this summer <sighs> kind of a setback week but carry on carry on all right hi friends it's um 6 5 p.m and you know where I am? I'm at work. I came into the office around one o'clock to cover things. I've had a steady flow of you know, work and things I'm catching up on. And I'm trying to do some continuing education. I don't know if anybody has a license for different things on whatever it is, but usually in most states you have to do continuing education so often to maintain your license. So with insurance and investment licenses, oh my God, people walk around our parking lot playing Pokemon is so funny. Anyway, I've been trying to do some of that ethics and insurance, blah, blah, blah. I have to do it every two years by my birthday, okay? My birthday is Wednesday the 27th of July. Uh, nothing like waiting to the last minute. I am notoriously bad. It's not a big deal. It's like $30 and then I take the class and I, you know, do an online test and I submit for certificate. But it's just like really boring. Insurance ethics is like I don't know, I think I'd rather, I think I'd rather sort my sock drawer. I don't have that many socks. I only work when I can. This week it was like just today and it's really hard to squeeze it into the schedule, but he took the afternoon off so it was really quiet. It was just kind of good because I'm sitting here in excruciating pain. I was supposed to, well, no, I'm still, I'm still actually within the window of the 800 milliliter, milligrams of Advil, but boy, right right around seven o'clock it's gonna wear off and I don't know if you know anything about thrombophlebitis it's a weird thing it's like my vein infection it's more painful this time I had it about a month ago and it was painful where it was located it's more painful in the spot where it is now it's like up up my leg more really hurting me and I'm kind of like 
hot. So I think maybe I'm just like a little sick and I don't feel good. I don't, I'm, I don't know, kind of a weird office because we're in a fishbowl. It's like we're sort of in the middle of a parking lot. So there's always cars and people going around, but I have the blinds down, so it's a little more private. Any hoo-ha, I'm gonna sign out now and lock up and close out and head home. We probably maybe might take Henry out. He needs to go somewhere. See how the nurse is doing with Daniel. I just, I needed a break. I'm, my body is so sore from lifting him and and he was fussy so that doesn't help things when daniel goes fussy it's harder because his muscles get spastic and you can't move him as easily when he's tight and it's crazy some days are just really hard anyway that's the deal there i'm gonna go now and i thought i would just share with you a little bit of what i was doing today in my professional world i can see how you feel a little bit Different from the rest of the world mm -hmm. The best part of coming home is... Hi! <laughs> Hi, you little wobble! Hi, you little wobble! How are ya? Hi! Hi! Did you miss me a lot? A lot and lots? Hello! Hi! Did you miss me? Huh? After being together and inseparable for days and days? How was school? Was school okay? Kind of the same? Not nice to get a little change of scenery? Were you fussy? Aww, I know. They were worried. I said, I said, he's fine. So, tonight's dinner that this wonderful daughter of mine planned and oh, oh. that John helped her prepare and Thomas is execute. healthy dinner number two this week well, is a well it's it's pretty good it's a macabre salad with chicken blue cheese eggs bacon Mine has avocado. and um Thomas avocado Mine. daddy has avocado right no dad doesn't like avocado but it's not much up okay so we know we've got some Watermelon slices and a little blue cheese and a little extra. She planned out the week. We planned out meals. Some food with this egg and chicken. I gave Henry some chicken already. I'm just saying, egg, and, egg and chicken's not bad for the boy either. Look at this. Sit down, eat your salad. Healthy living. All right. You're the big boy. Can you grab a few knives, Mom? All right. I'll grab a few knives and that is so nice. Oh, no. oh God, I'm like limping all over the house. Blue cheese smells like what? Okay. Hey you. You got two things going on here. You got the iPad and what? I love you. I love you. Dad's gonna hang out with you for a half an hour. We're gonna bring we're gonna take Henry over to the dog park and give him a good exercising because he's kind of been cooked up this week. He really needs to run and there he can like run it out. So we're gonna go before it gets really dark outside. And we have touchdown, touchdown. I love these fancy pink dog poop bags at the dog park. They're so nice. Come on, run it out. Oh, friend. Hi, friend. Up, 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 up. There you go. Hi. Well, he'll go if somebody else goes. Hello. Hello, friend. Oh, hello, friend. Oh, my goodness. I thought we were talking about that friend. I didn't realize there was a friend right here. Oh, hi. Yeah. Henry. Oh, Henry's over there. <laughs> You're cute. Hi. <laughs> hi. Hi, my little beagle boy. Hi. Hi, my boy. And then we have our husky friend. Yes, love you. <laughs> Good boy, Henry. I know, I gotta throw the poop away. All I can smell is your poo. Hi, guys. Can you go walk over to the garbage can? Yeah, I'm gonna go back up. Hi. <laughs> I love you. You're so friendly. You're soft. So soft. Yeah. So, so. Henry. Hi. Hi, like. You're loving the poop. Mm. Great. Good boy. Good job, Henry. You'd be a great boy today. You do awesome. That was the doggies. Come on, just keep walking around. Come on, walk around. 
get him, honey. Come on, keep walking. Come on, come on. We're gonna go around. Get your exercise. Come on. Come on, Henry. Come on, Henry. Come on. Okay, I gotta put the water in it first, dude. Okay. There you go. All right. Go to town. Good boy. Thirsty? Keep drinking. Want more water? Hen? Oh. Good night, little dog. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> we got a little cold air going here. Huh. You tired? You went to the doggies? You did. You did a good job there. You did. You want to roll over? Feel the fan? Oh, that's nice. I'm so tired. <coughs> oh. Sneezy boy wonder over there. Good night, world. It was an okay day today. Look, Daniel's sound asleep. See, Daniel? Sound asleep. He snoozed. He went to school today, and I guess he's, they really missed him. He wasn't there all week. So, here's Daddy coming to see what's happening in the everything room. Where's your phone? Why? Somebody Why? sent you some texts. Somebody sent you a text message. You did? Okay. Fine, I gotta go read my text. How are you doing? I just deleted all my posts for the sporty. What? I just deleted what I what I just 